Montenegro and on our way to our first warm showers host in Mexico. <laughs> um, we're excited what awaits us there. <laughs> we'll be only able to camp in their garden, but yeah, we can hopefully take a shower. <laughs> I can't cycle here. <laughs> So the last meters to her place are turning out to be a bit of a nightmare because it's just super fine sand. And if you just miss the solid part by a bit, you just slip. It's, oh my god, it's just impossible to even just get going again. It's like silt. Here it's a little bit better. It's not as deep, so you can kind of cycle on it. Okay. <laughs> 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 so that was really, really cold. But it was worth it because after eight nights while well, camping, it was nice just to. You feel a bit disgusting. You feel a bit disgusting. You know, you feel clean. Yeah. <laughs> and now with clothes on. It's warm again. Yeah. <laughs> you will still be here tomorrow, but your dreams may not. So as you can see here on the little shrubs, we have an absolutely great tailwind again. Yeah, it's just been really amazing cycling, or still is really amazing cycling north to south in Baja because it's just so much tailwind, which we've just never had before. And, and it's really hot because now the wind is like going like 30 kmh like we are, and you just, it's, it's, it's as if you don't have any wind and it's just super, super warm. <laughs> of Baja is definitely, or Baja Sur, is definitely not flat. <laughs> but the gradients are always so far okay, like they're not Croatia steep, let's just put it that way. <laughs> um, and it, the climbs are usually not too long either, which is good.
so we're just cycling into Loreto now um, on the Gulf Coast of Baja and it's um, it's just the whole town you could see it coming down from the mountains it's just a dust bowl it's crazy just the whole every the whole town area is just one big dust cloud that's crazy they're actually watering the roads so it doesn't uh, so there's not so much dust kicked up it's crazy <laughs> Yeah, we weren't sure, like, are you behind us, are you in front of us? How did Ensenada yeah. treat you guys? Good, yeah, it was good. So we ran into Sam and Trenton again, with whom we cycled uh, the day before, or no, into Ensenada. Um, yeah, and now here in Loreto, we met them again <laughs> and they actually met another girl, Danielle, who's also cycling Baja, California and they've been cycling together and we're gonna have some ice cream now. Hola! Uh, can I go on a pregunta? Um, is it allowed to play uh, la musica on uh, the street? La musica? Si, just with a guitar. Con oh. la guitarra on aquí? How can I try to explain when I do it turns away? It's always been the same. So that was actually our first time busking again in a quite a long time, um, pretty much since Europe. Because um, we, yeah, we tried it once in the US and it wasn't really possible because of private property. And now we did it once uh, at Denny's food store. Um, yeah, this is the proper first proper real time since Europe, really. And we asked the police here as well and they said it's no problem. And it's, yeah, it was really cool just to play again. It's, it's a nice feeling. And um, yeah, hopefully we can do it a lot more now in, um, in Mexico and beyond. Yeah. And um, yeah, we uh, left uh, Trent and Sam and their friend Danny, I think, Danielle, who they were cycling with. Um, now again already, because we wanted to spend some time in um in laredo and now we're gonna keep cycling on though soon and just camp somewhere so this is quite the climb we're doing here. You can literally see the road below winding up and without a shoulder and windy and lots of cars and also big trucks it's not the safest either but the view is pretty cool. <laughs> Holy crap, I don't know if you can see that, but there's a little tornado there. There's a torn. Oh my god. Hey man, Louisa, stop, stop, stop. Wow. You can really see it going like up all the way. Pass, which means that we will have then uh, yeah, crossed Baja 
and we will take a ferry from La Paz to Mazatlan on the mainland on Tuesday probably today's Friday <laughs> um, and the last days the landscape has gotten a bit boring kind of after we left Loreto uh, we went through the mountains which was cool and after that just became flat and yeah, desert and it looks like this all the time <laughs> started to go up and down the whole time and it's so hot and we would actually like to just stop for today but everything's fenced in since yesterday morning already actually but uh, yesterday afternoon we were lucky and there was a hole in the fence like for a small road but here's nothing, everything is fenced in and yeah, we just can't find a way to get inside there to find a decent camping spot. Which means we have to keep cycling in the heat and so there is a hole in the fence and we're gonna check that out. But there are so many cars here and we don't wanna be seen. We have to wait a bit. So going through a hole in the fence onto private, well, what might be private property, we don't know, it's hard to say here, it's definitely not our preferred way of doing it, but as the day was going now with all the fence fencing, like we most likely we wouldn't have found anything else. So we did this today, but this area and this road looks so deserted anyway. I hope it should be fine. of how we expected but it is uh, pretty touristy in La Paz um, especially obviously the center here on the and the promenade it's pretty touristy <laughs> All right, now we're leaving the place in La Paz where we stayed with uh, Gabi for three nights. We went to the movies together yesterday and uh, yeah, just got a lot of stuff done and chilled a lot. <laughs> um, yeah, and now we're actually gonna have some ice cream with Trent and Sam and Daniel. One more time. <laughs> again, because they're also in La Paz. Um, and then we're going to the ferry and crossing to the mainland of Mexico. And it's an overnight Exciting. ferry. Yes. Because it's uh, 12 hours or something. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Oh my God. Bye. Enjoy. Take care.